Good afternoon. Well, let me check. I was about to say good afternoon. Good evening, everybody. Good evening, teacher. Okay, can you see me? No, not yet, right? Uh, no. Let me check. I think there's an issue with the background. Okay, so now it's ready. If I'm not mistaken. Hi, good evening. Good evening. Welcome. How is it going? Thank you. How are you feeling? Better than yesterday. Awesome. Is it because it's Thank Friday? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. That's one true. reason. There That's is. one reason. Yes. Thank you. Okay, so we're ready. What happened? Okay, so I was checking the the backgrounds and I got this frame. So why? Why the frame with the happy emojis? Because it's Friday, you are going to have a nice weekend and um, we are going to have fun. So that is the, that's one of the purposes for Fridays, right? That we can, uh, relax a little bit, but at the same time, learn a lot. So um, let me see who's here. Okay, Juan Jose, good evening. Can you hear me well? Um, good evening, I'm not well, <laughs> I'm sick. You're sick? Oh yeah. man. Uh, um, I, I stayed up uh, until think, I don't know, but I, I feel bad. I, oh, I that's be connected, but but I don't know if I would stay at home too. I get it. I get it. Okay, I'm sorry about that. I tried. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have, have you taken any medicine? Yes. Yes. Some. Yes. Some pills. Yes. But, mm -hmm. um, but uh, always I'm sick. sick. <laughs> okay. Okay. Excellent. Um, okay, good Thank evening, for... teacher. Hello, good evening. Good evening, teacher. I'm Gustavo. Okay, Gustavo. Gust uh, I don't know if you see the, the message from uh, WhatsApp. Uh, uh... I go out from my work right now from San Salvador to Aguachapan. Uh, only goodness. I can hear the class for this day because it's, it's a long trip uh, that I have. Yeah. Okay, so, okay. Uh, I'm staying here, but only I can I can hear, okay? Yeah, 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 I got it. Thank you for letting me okay. know about that. Okay. Uh, okay, I just saw your message right now. So thank you for uh, connecting and uh, drive safely, right? So you can get to your destination safe and sound. Um, so we're going to check who else is here. Diana, you're back. Hello, good evening, yes. Good evening. <laughs> Here I am again. Okay, so. Good evening. Good evening, Fabio. How's it going? It's fine. I went to the gym today. <laughs> awesome, okay, that's excellent. I want to go to the gym as well. Maybe, maybe soon. Okay, yeah, it's kind of complicated, right? But maybe, not... maybe Monday. <laughs> maybe on Monday, yeah. Not sure which Monday, but on Monday. Okay, uh, Jackie, how are you doing? Smiling as usual. Very good. Awesome. Um, let me see, Brenda, <laughs> can you hear me? Thank you, Yaki. I'm not sure. Let's check. Uh, Flor is still working, but she's uh, listening to us. Uh, Blanca? I'm here. Are Hello. you doing okay? Mm, I'm not 
well because I'm tired. The day I, I have an accident and well, it doesn't happen nothing to me, but I was in the bus car <laughs> and uh, a truck. Uh, I don't know how to say that punch the back the back part of the car. Really? How can I say that? Yeah. He, I mean, they they uh, hit hit your car but uh, uh, in the back. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, well, okay. no, not my car. <laughs> Is that my bus car? Your bus she, car. Okay. Yeah. She. I don't know. Presto. How can I say that? In this case, uh, well, we're talking about borrowing a car, but it's more like, it's that, did she pay for that or it was just like for free? No, and no. Uh, I have to go out from my work and mm -hmm. my, my boss gave me the card because I, I go close. I, I have to go to close, mm -hmm. and when I came back with the, in the to work, mm -hmm. uh, that happens. Uh, mm -hmm. A truck hit me in the back part wow. of the car, <sighs> and it was a long afternoon because I have to wake uh, under the sun. <laughs> wow! <laughs> and it was too tired and the police never came came to the place mm -hmm. and i have to to make a a negotiation with the with the guy who hit with, you yeah mm -hmm. it was an an old man oh, okay. and i have to wake a lot a lot a lot well, okay. but it, it was I, I I can uh, I have a good a good answer about that because I go to the I don't know how to say taller to the shop to the workshop mm -hmm. yeah and and they they going to pay for the heat okay okay <laughs> thank God you are okay yeah, and the problem is yeah, and I came to to my home, and I I'm, I was so tired that I have to go to sleep, and my mom just wake up to me, <laughs> just walk, just woke up, up to me. <laughs> she just, just woke, woke me up. Woke me up. Woke me up. Okay. Yeah. That's good. That's that's what she yeah. has to do when you're sleeping before the class. <laughs> yeah, okay. yeah. 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 Okay. Uh, thank you, Blanca, for um making that effort right even though it was a really hard day i think that mariela is feeling a little bit bad today but she's here with us too and um diego good evening welcome hi teacher good evening how are you doing today i'm fine fine okay ready to start yes. uh, francisco good evening teacher Hello, good evening. My classmate. How are you feeling today? Mm, good, normally. Normal? Yes. Okay, as usual. Yes, Got usually it. date. It was a usual day. Okay, so welcome everybody. I'm going to take the attendance quickly and then we're going to start with today's uh, activities. Um, so the first person in the list, we know that is Beatriz but she's not here yet uh mariela i'm here blanca i'm here brenda diana diana i think we, we lost contact with diana uh yeah probably she got some connection issues 
or I don't know, it's, it seems like she's not listening to me right now, but she's there. Yeah, she's frozen. Yana. <laughs> Hello. Hello. I was Did taking the attendance, so yeah, I was calling you. Oh, I'm calling sorry. You. <laughs> Hello, here I am. Okay. Luckily, your camera was on, so I knew that you were there. Um, okay, Diego? I'm here. Uh, okay, Flor is uh, solving some issues at work, uh, but she's there. Francisco? Fredis is not here yet. Laura? Probably coming in a moment. Uh, Jackie? I'm here. Harvin? Not here yet. So we continue with Jennifer. Coming soon. Juan Jose. I'm here. I'm here. Okay. Thank you, Juan Jose. Luis Gustavo is driving right now. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm here, but I'm driving. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Don't worry. Uh, Miguel Angel. Fabio. I'm here. Uh, Rolando is not here yet. And then we have Janari. Roxana. Hi, teacher. Hello. Elizabeth and Suleyma are the other two girls. I think they are co workers, if I'm not, if, if my, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, so we're going to uh, go on and First of all, uh, what do you remember about yesterday's class, guys? What did we do? What did we study? What did we practice? What it was a trivia day. <laughs> yes, it, it was, the trivia was part of the day, uh -huh, part of the class. Anything else? It was not just the trivia. There was something else. Hey, yeah, Rolanda, yeah. welcome. Uh huh. Hello, hello. How's it going? I'm fine. I'm fine. Okay, everything's all right. So, um, we had a trivia, as Blanca mentioned. What else? We talk about complex subjects. Complex subjects. That was a little bit tricky, right? Um, remember that in every module we are going up. I mean, the le the level of difficulty it's going up. So, um, and that's a good sign, right? That we are improving and we are we are dealing with more complex or more complicated uh, topics, more technical words. So everything is is getting. Uh, or is going to a higher level, right? To the next level. So, uh, Francisco said in the, in the chat that we will practice testing. Testing what? What was the topic, the conversation about? Testing what? Testing products. Testing products. Okay. So, um, we talked about one type of testing. Well, two types of testing that you discuss in the questions. Do you remember which ones they were? Sight and handling. Sight and handling, uh -huh. and? And um, what's the other one? I forgot the another one. <laughs> but you remember the most difficult one. Use, use the product. Yeah, the, the product the use, use testing. right? The using testing, that's correct. So um, use testing. So you have two different approaches yeah. and then- um, She remembered the most difficult. Yeah, she remembered the most difficult, right? Sight and handling. So um, that's basically what we were studying, but that's not all, right? There are more things. And we discuss about the importance of testing the product, right? For the customer's safety, especially. Um, so, 
Uh, we're going to move on. And the other thing that, we're that we were doing is trying to remember a little bit about the previous um, class and also the previous vocabulary. So we started five different questions, five different words that we started related to the stages of a product, right? So we had the commercialization, the product analysis, right? So all of those stages were relevant and it's new vocabulary for you. So you have to remember that, right? Um, now, I am going to share the screen, right? Just for you to see yesterday's picture. Uh, I'm, I will send it to the WhatsApp group, right? So you keep it there for the week one picture. And here it is. Okay, perfect. So you can see your faces right there. Uh, people who could turn on the camera, right? So that was the, the memory of the week one. Now we're going to go on and, uh, okay, Blanca, I think that's a Korean heart, right? My students told me about that little sign or gesture that you do with your hands. Yeah, uh, it, it, uh, the, the photo that, that I put in the, this, this session, it, it do the same, the same sign. Uh-huh, okay. Nice. And let's go yeah, on. Yeah. And Freddie was looking at his, at his crush, right? That is his wife. <laughs> so we're going to go on and the session number seven, right? That is a fun Friday. Um, that's going to be a name. So we remember that every day for us for something in particular. So Thursday are going to be remembered for the trees, right? And Fridays are going to be remembered for the word fun. So fun Friday. And um, what are we going to do? Well, first of all, we are going to um, try to remember a little bit about what the subject verb agreement is about. So I'm going to share with you on the screen a little quiz. Uh, it's not as complex as the topic that we studied yesterday and we're going to continue studying today, but it's just to give you an idea about what what subject verb agreement is about. So we're going to have that little quiz uh, using the same app, the same uh, site that we were using yesterday. And um, besides that, besides that, we are going to talk a little bit about the, the way in which we can use this. And we're going to start, okay? Talking a little bit about different type or different strategies for testing products different methods for testing products so uh that is for today's class right so we already had the review from yesterday's class and uh it's time to have fun learn and practice so this is the link that i will share with you through the Check. Mm, I think I'm going to try me controlling the questions, right? So we go in order. Mm, let me check. Yeah. So here we go. I'm going to share the screen and I will share the link with you as well. So you can access the, the quiz. There you go. You can open it now. And I will share the screen. If you're driving, obviously if you're working, it's not possible for you to turn on the the camera i understand if you cannot play the game that i understand for this moment so later you can join us right okay so subject verb agreement okay i gave you some examples yesterday but we're going to study more today so that everybody is an is an expert in using subject verb 
agreement when using the language. Okay, Rolando, Anonymous, uh -huh. Jackie, Beatriz, Roberto, Fabio is there, Diego, Blanca, Juan, Juan Jose, hello, I don't know who hello is. Yes. Okay, we have 10 participants already connected. 11, Roxy is there now. Just click on the link that I shared through the chat and that's it. Okay, write down your name and then you join the game. So we're going to start as soon as we have the majority of you connected to the game. Deal Drew. Okay, so we got 12 um, participants already. I think we're going to get started. Let me check how many, well, I, I am part of the number. So one, two, three, that will be 16. We got 12, uh, two people cannot join us and Okay, so we're ready, set, and let's go. We will go one by one, okay? Everybody in the same questions. The first one, the children. Get up or gets up at 7 a.m. every day. Remember, only one is correct. Okay, so we already have uh, some answers. Okay, the correct answer obviously was the children get up. Okay, so you see the results there. Only one person got it wrong. That's okay, this is practice, okay, to help you understand what subject verb agreement is about. This is the basic uh, examples, right, that, that I can give you. So next one. Kathy, TV every day after work, watch or watches? Those are the options. Okay, we've got 11 answers. One person is missing. Okay, perfect. Everybody got it. And the correct answer was Kathy watches, right? Okay, excellent. So remember that when you answer, uh, Okay, yeah, we need to make a modification to the verb because we are talking about she, right? About Kathy, that would be about her, right? So Kathy in pronouns is represented by she, right? So she watches TV every day after work. So we need to make a modification because it's a simple present and it's a singular third person uh, subject. So we go with the next one. My friend 
live or lives on my street a few blocks away. Remember, you have to pay attention if the subject is plural or singular, so the verb has to match with the subject. That is subject verb agreement, okay? Two people are missing. Hello, who is hello? I don't know, please choose an answer. Three, two, one, time is up. So we continue to the next question. The correct answer was my friend lives. Okay. We usually do or does the dishes after dinner. We usually Okay, so the correct answer was do. Okay, we usually do the dishes. So we have a little problem with one participant who's not answering, but we're going to move on to the next question. Let me check. Question number five. My grandmother go or goes to the grocery store every Saturday. If you are not playing in the in the game, you can answer them by yourself, right? In your notebook, you write down the number of the question. This is number five and the answer that you think is correct. And later you can check if you are right or not. So this this case, my grandmother goes was the correct answer. Okay, so we continue with the next one. Number six. The little girl play or plays with her kitten. The little girl, easy, plays, okay, plays with her kitten. So we continue with the next one. Number seven. It a long time to become a doctor. It take or it takes a long time. Okay, so the correct answer in this case was it takes. Okay, so let's go to number eight. She, a lot of money. She has or she have. All right, so we got the 11 answers. We go to the next one. The little boy. Cry or cries when he fall or falls down. Okay, we got 11. The correct answer was the second option, right? Cries and falls. Next one. My next door neighbor. Cook or cooks dinner 
every night. The correct answer was cooks, okay? Number 11, the teacher work or works very hard. The correct answer is Okay, we're missing one answer. Okay, perfect. Works. Number 12, quickly. My parents give me money to buy lunch or gives me money. My parents. Okay, my parents give me, okay, without the S. That was the correct answer. Next. Lucy wakes or wake up early and goes or go to work. Okay, three, two, one. Okay, perfect. So we'll continue with the next one. The correct answer was wakes up and goes to work. Number 14, we're getting to the, to the end. They buy or buys a cup of coffee and a bagel. Okay, the correct answer, they buy. 15 out of 20. Their job require or requires a lot of patience and hard work. Okay, their job requires with the S at the end. That was the correct answer. Next one, number 16. They enjoy or they enjoys meeting new people. Okay, they enjoy. That was the correct answer. Next one. Sometimes I meet or meet with friends for dinner. Okay, three, two, one, and time is up. Okay, the correct answer is sometimes I meet, meet with friends for dinner. I have or I has to get up early for school. In this case, for work.
Okay, so I have to. Next one, 19, we're almost done. One more after this one. We do or we does homework every day. That's a piece of cake for you. All right, so we got 11 answers. So we do, okay, the last one. This is easy too. Mom make or makes breakfast every morning. Five, four, three, two, one, you're done. So yes, let's go to the final answers. Dun, 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 dun. So we have Deal, Drew, okay, Anonymous, and Rolando. <laughs> okay, so excellent. The summary is right here, right? So you can take a look at the answers. The, you got the majority of them right, so the percentage was really high. And let's go on. Okay, it's raining now and sunny up. I'm going to stop sharing and go to the next part. Okay, guys, so now it's time to share your answers. So you are going to go into the breakout rooms so that you can share and discuss and answer the exercise from yesterday that I asked you to try to complete by yourself, right? Remember? And so this was the explanation that we started that, and then we went to the exercise. So the exercise number five, you were, well, you need to, you, you need to read the statements and choose the verb form that agrees with the subject. So you have two options, as you see here, but only one is correct. So I want you to do two things. First of all, uh, express your opinion about which one you think is correct and why, okay? Then you discuss, right? Everybody gives the opinion and you get to an agreement, okay? Which one you think is the correct answer. So you do the same for the number one, two, three, four, five, six, and after that, I'm going to take you back to the, to the group session so that we can check the answers. Okay, so right now you're going to the breakout rooms. You're going to be working in groups of three, approximately. Uh, here we go. Welcome, Jennifer. Thanks, teacher. Good evening. Okay, we have Jennifer. Fred is here. Excellent. And I think that we are complete. Yeah. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Okay, one, two, and three. Let me just make one more adjustment, and that's it. Okay, perfect. So we're ready to go. Uh, So how much time do you have for this? Okay, good question, Amelia. For this, you will have exactly 10 minutes maximum, okay? Because I need you to discuss why you think the answer is correct. And uh, if somebody was done in class, you can give an idea, right? About why that, that answer is correct. So I set the invitation now. I will see you in 10 minutes.
have some of the participants in the testing group have not arrived yet. Oh. Some of the participants in this in the testing group. Have I you got any questions? Have. 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 Everyone. If you have doubts, remember to go back to the explanation so you can clarify, okay, what the answer, the correct answer can be. Okay, that is in exercise four. Thank you. I don't to this. I am the best type of this. The, the number one is how the, the, the correct. I so agree with participate you. in the testing group how arrive yet. Why? Right. I agree with you. think you. how is correct. So you need to know why it is correct. Okay, that is important. You have to give a reason. Ooh, um, why is, is have and not has? In this case, because the some some yes yes uh, not only one yes. uh, not only one. But uh, mm. it will be than... is uh -huh. no no the third one I think is uh, because it's talking about more than only one customer. The of course, customer is in course. plural. Sure. Customers is in plural. Uh -huh. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Okay. It's, it's for R. the reason that we have R. Yeah. Okay. R. For the third one, this number four, Fabio. Number four. The first of the suggestion I want to implement is the design of the label. Is. Here mm -hmm. is. I have yes. this be is because it's for, only talking yes. about only one. For first, for the word first. For the word first, right. Okay. We lost, we lost. <laughs> hmm? ah. <laughs> I see a Jessica disappear. Jessica. Okay. Number, Number five. Four. Yeah. Number five. Uh, a majority of testers have pointed out the need to make our product lighter. And in this case, he, I think it's how, because it's in plural, a majority, right? I have uh, have to. No, 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 I'm no. sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's has, it's has. It's has. Or no. No, 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 no. Has it for no. singular, have, right? Have, 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 right? Have. Have. Yes, if but have. it's have. have. For plural. For plural, right? Yes. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. I'm we sorry, I'm that. sleeping. It's for the <laughs> I'm also a bit of sleeping. A number of <laughs> comments suggest that the fragrance oh. of the candle is the best characteristic. Mm. characteristic. I suggest suggest a number of comments suggest. Take, take a look at the at the explanation, okay? In the exercise four to clarify the, the rules. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Next, an exercise four. Uh -huh. What exercise, teacher? The previous to the exercise. There you have the explanations. Ah. Oh. Ah. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. Um, like in exactly. Okay. okay. Let's start. Number one. Some of the participants. <laughs> Sorry, go ahead, Jackie. Don't worry. <laughs> Don't worry, Jenny. Some of, some of the participants in the testing group have a, haven't or have not arrived yet. Arrived. 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 Sorry. Arrived yet. Thank you. Okay. I will read the second one. One of the factors to decide on the best type of test 
is the characteristics of the of the product itself. Okay, and the number three. A number of customers are satisfied with the performance on the new mop. I don't know if that's the correct uh, pronunciation. Uh, satisfied. <laughs> satisfied or satisfied, I don't know. I think it's satisfied. satisfied. With the sound D at the end. Satisfied. 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 Okay. Okay. Number four, the first um, of the su suggestions I want to impl implement is the design of the label. First of the, of the label. Ah, label. label. Thank you. You're welcome. Label. A majority of testers have point out. Um, we finished, teacher, but uh, just for being sh be sure, we, we want to ask you something. In the number three and number six, a number of comments, it's related, related with a group of something, right? Hmm. My goodness. Hold on. There was a, a really... Uh, shocking lightning almost in front of me. Okay. Hello? He has problems. Connection problem. Hello, good evening. Hello. Can you hear me? Hello. Hello, good evening. Okay, guys, there is there is a really strong electric storm here in Samuel right now. I just got a big lightning in front of my window. <laughs> that was crazy. I thought that the, the lights were going to go off, but only the connection. Oh my God. Only the connection went off, yeah. Uh, oh my God. It is scared me to be honest with you, but uh, I already got connection from my cell phone to go on. Uh, not sure about the time because I cannot see how much time it's been. Uh, but I think the majority of you were done with the. Yes. With the, with the answer, right? With the exercise. Uh, hold on a second. I just want to check. Okay, I am the host. Good. Uh, going to check the recording. Yeah, it is recording right now. I'm not sure how much time it's being recorded, but anyways, we're going to go on. I think it's 51 minutes, so it's okay. Before I uh, ask you for the answers, I am going to take the attendance. So do you say here or present? Beatrice? 
she's here, but. But we can hear her, okay. Uh, Mariela? Present. Nice. Blanca? I'm going to keep my camera off because. Uh, I'm here. I'm going to consume more data. Okay, uh, Diana? I'm here. Okay, good. Uh, Diego? I'm here. Floor? Thank you. Francisco? Present teacher. Ready? I'm here, teacher. Laura, Jackie, present, Arvin, Jennifer, I'm here teacher, Juan Jose, I'm here, Luis Gustavo, I'm here teacher, okay, Miguel Angel, Fabio, Rolando, I'm here, Yanari, I'm here teacher, Excellent. I'm here teacher, Irma, Roxana, present, present, Elizabeth and Suleyma are not here I think, and so let's go on. I'm going to share the screen. Um, hopefully it's going to be possible. Uh, okay, uh, here it is. Number one, I we already got this one, uh, if I'm not mistaken, but uh, can I get a volunteer for number one, please? Me? Hey. It's just me, Diana. Okay, go ahead, please. Uh, some of the participants in the testing group have not arrived yet. Okay, so you mentioned, you said that is have. Okay, um, number two. Have. Uh, number two, volunteers. We're going to check the answers at the end. Me teacher. Okay, go ahead, Rolando. One of the factors to decide on the best type of test is the characteristics of the product itself. The characteristics, characteristics of the product itself. Okay, thank you. Number three. Can I to try? Okay, please. Uh, number three, a number of customers are satisfied with the performance of the new map. Of the new map. Okay, thank you. Number four. Hi. Okay. Who? Roxana, no, who said me? Hello? Who will try number four? Sure, I want to implement, uh, okay. yes. Please. of the label yes so what answer do you think is correct is or are is. 
Okay. Thank you. Number five. For not. We're going to check the answers in a moment. Okay, number five. Raise your hand or write in the chat or activate the microphone so that I know that you want to try or you want to participate. Okay, Blanca. Hi, teacher. Yeah, a majority of tester had point out the new the need to make our product lighter. Up, pointed, pointed out, pointed out, right? Pointed out. Pointed out. Okay, excellent. Number six. One more. One more. Me teacher. Okay, let's see. Yes, a number of comments suggest that the fragrance of the candle is the best characteristic. Suggest. Suggest. Yes. Without yes. yes. Yeah. Okay. So now is the critical time when we're going to check who was right and who needs to correct the sentence. So um, in this case, something that you have to remember is that uh, we are talking about complex subjects, right? So it's not normal subjects. These are a little bit more, let's say difficult, just a little bit. Okay, so as you, well, I don't know, can you see it? What can you see on your screen right now? The same slide with exercise. Okay, okay. Um, so, the number one, uh, some of the participants in the testing group have or has not arrived. Do you think this is correct? Is this is the correct answer? Raise your hand if you think that is have. Yes, have. Yes, okay, Diana, Rolando, Francisco, Roxana, thank you so much, Freddy's. Good, you can raise your hand or give me a thumbs up. Correct, have not arrived. Okay, number two, I'm going to use the reactions for the volunteers. So yes, number one was correct. Number two, raise your hand if you think that the correct answer is is. is one of the factors to decide on the best type of test is the characteristics of the product itself. Okay, very good. So is is the correct answer. Awesome, let me go on with the next one. Number three, raise your hand if you think that the correct answer is are a number of customers are satisfied with the performance of the new map okay we have six people saying that that is the correct answer so a number of customers are correct number four the first of the suggestions i want to implement if you think the answer is is, use a reaction, please. If you think the correct answer is is. Yes, you are right. So the first of the series I want to implement is the design of the label. Excellent. Thank you so much to the volunteers. So far, so good. So I'm going to give you a thumbs up. Uh, number five, a majority of testers have or has pointed out the need to make our product lighter. Raise your hand if you think the correct answer is have. 
raise your hand or give me a reaction, use a reaction if you think it's the correct answer. Have. Okay, we got six people, seven, nine. Okay, nine people say that is correct. 10 people, 11. Okay, so the majority of you said that. And yes, it's correct. Have pointed out. That's the correct answer. And the last one, a number of comments suggest or suggests that the fragrance of the candle is the best characteristic. Raise your hand if you think that the correct answer is suggests with S. Suggests. How many people think that is correct? Suggests. Okay, only three people think that is correct. So the rest of you think that is suggest without the S. And you are right. The correct answer is without the S. So a number of comments suggest that the fragrance of the candle is the best characteristic. So great job. Let me use another one. I will use a heart. So all of the answers were correct this time. That means that you are getting it. I, Hello, you have a question? I can hear you so, so well. I think. Uh -huh. Okay, don't worry, I, I, I get it. So I am going to do the following, okay? Pay attention. I am going to send you back to the breakout rooms, okay? And you are going to answer a test. by yourselves okay i am not going to help you i am not going to give you any answer i am not going to answer any question you are going to answer the test the way that you and your group or your team think is correct so um i will share the link through the chat so that you can access to the quiz and just give me a second, okay? I want to make sure that it's open. Mm. I'm afraid. Dun, 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 dun. I look for the most difficult one. So let's say that the, 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 the practice that we have right now is like intermediate, intermediate level, right? So right now we're going to the advanced. It's a combination of advanced and intermediate. So this is the link to the quiz. And when you enter the breakout room, one person is going to share the screen and click on start. So you're going to start the test. It's 20 questions, okay, 20 questions. And then you are going to check your results, right? And analyze which questions were difficult, which questions you don't understand. So you can take notes and then when we come back, you ask me, okay, teacher, we had some problems with this question, okay? Because we don't understand why this is incorrect or why this is the correct answer, right? So I'm going to open the breakout rooms. Hopefully the connection is going to be stable. Ready? Set. And go now you have exactly 15 minutes maximum to complete the quiz 15 minutes if you need more time let me know please Uh, Brenda, are you there? Okay, be careful, please. Don't worry, you're going to be listening to your classmates. Okay, perfect. Jennifer, do you get the invitation? 
Yes, perfect. So we get excellent. Hello, teacher. Hello. Hello, teacher. We are just studying. Okay, perfect. Sep Good luck. I. You will need it. Okay. Oh my God. <laughs> it means I muchas razones. There are many reasons. I think that it's reason. Reason is the, the, the subject. Yeah. Um. Okay. Number two, our team play or plays for every night. Our team play. He. Your eye didn't go to shopping today. The subject near your eye. Uh, are. Which is the sentences? Okay, number you have three. To click, you have to click start. Ah, okay. The first one, Roxana, is reason. Okay. Start the quiz. Reason. Let's see. Press the blue button so, so you can start the quiz. The button that say start. Yes, that button. Oh, yeah. Uh... Uh, I didn't understand. Yeah, press that button and then you start answering one by one. Answering the questions one by one. Here. Oh, here. Letter B? Letter B? Letter B? Letter B? Yeah. Teacher, teacher. Uh -huh. Here we have moms usually, but moms it says I don't know. Internet. Hello. Hello. I have bad connection right now, so that's the reason why I cannot hear it so well. Me too. But take <laughs> notes. Take notes about the questions that you have doubts, and later you will ask me. Okay. 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 Thank you, teacher. Make um, yes, yeah. Here, I have I have a question, Make guys. Right, guys, it is necessary for you to press the the, the start button. Uh, we need to. Oh. There's a a bottom at the top of the page that is a in blue, so you have to click there. Start, start the quiz. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh my God. <laughs> yes, question. Yes, it's, this <laughs> there, esa mi pregunta. I told you. There are another question. There are another question. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, okay. 
Christina and yeah, I, and I are making. We're are baking. Back. I ate. Yeah. I was. <laughs> oh my God. What is that? That is the weather to buy a rent house. Whether to buy or rent a house is an important financial question. Si yeah. compro o no yeah. o rento una casa. Si compro o rento. Manager. Being my it's, best friend. It's the same. It's the same as the other one we have we have run uh, because. Uh, there is there is a rule there that probably you are not you don't know so. Sí. The official manager, mm -hmm. and in that time, so you selected A. Yeah. B. Uh, a, a, right. A, we yeah. select A. A. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, next. Next. Uh, Sorry, my internet is, is slow. Hey, this one he has. Uh, it are my aunt. You are. I hear the like robots. Yes. Um, I don't know what happened with my internet. The afternoon. Well, I can hear you. Very well, but I don't know what, what can we do? Mm. You can use the chat probably. Okay. okay. Please, Roxana, can you choose the answer? Okay. Which uh, number, uh, A or B? Uh, Tina or... That, that's... Oh, do... That's... Tina or her work co-workers? That's, that's Tina. That's, I think it's us. Okay. Okay, letter A. No. Next case. Okay. I stop. Correct. The <laughs> internet is super bad. Next. Mm. Okay, that's the... My favorite subjects. Has been, been fifteen years old. Next. I um. Correct. Next. It's very, very slow. Mom. Okay, that's the next. Usually, moms. I don't know what this mom. Usually, mom. A spread or a spritz throws saliva. I don't know what is moms. I'm going to I think it's I'm not sure I will like it. Moms. My shirts, my shirts aren't. I think that it's aren't. Ah, moms are paperas. 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 <gasps> really, what's a new word for me? My shirts sharp enough. Mm, aren't. Correct. Mm -hmm. 
Correct. Okay. Next. Next. Correct. Eighty percentage of his furniture um, is all. There are many ways to say thank you. R, letter B. 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 One of her cats doesn't like tuna. Central office manager, along with his two assistants, have left the room. Have. The central office. Doesn't. Doesn't. Yes. Mm. All right. I can hear you well. Don't worry. But I yeah. try to ask. It was worked out. He has been, has, he has, or he has been <clears throat> my best friend since first grade. Let us see. Oh. What did you say? Uh, Claudia, as well as Judy, speak, speak. Yeah, with the S. $20 are not a lot of money these days. <laughs> right? $20. I think it's A, but I don't know. I think it's B, Anna. I think it's B. Okay, the majority says B. <gasps> I told you. <laughs> Point for Freddy. <laughs> okay. Dollars. It's not plural dollars. But you're talking about okay. the amount as a as 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 one. Oh. Twenty dollars is a lot of money. <laughs> there is are several reasons. Or B. B. A. A. B. Yeah. Or I, well, I, I don't. I think it's A. <laughs> Try with A. We have. <laughs> We have we have to listen to oh, the food with I can the see easy. I can see the other question. Ah, okay, okay, right. Anthony and Dishan. They, right? We're talking about they. Please, we're talking about they. What are, do you say in front say of are. <laughs> Francisco, give us the, the, the right answer, please. Wow, the shine is finished. Was... The shine is another person. Yeah, it's another boy. Anthony, Anthony and the shine. The oh. there, there is another person. Francisco says R. I think that I say R too. Yeah, it's R. B. Yeah, me too. 
There you go. I'm, I'm tired of being wrong. <laughs> Near the center of the campus are the cons consular's offices. Is yes. or are? What are they talking about? Or are. You need to connect the verb to okay. the to the to the to what is talking about, what is related to. We're talking about the, the office of the consular. The consular. Ah, uh, mm. B is 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 B because the consular is plural. Offices. Plural. No. The consular's office. Yes. Okay, we have. We we should hear the answer of Francisco because he got I, it. I think that is B. He's he's in a. I on, think on it's a, B. A, He's on a good strike right now. He's got a B. lucky strike. Oh my God. <laughs> B. I, I think that is B. Yeah, B. it's offices. Oh offices is plural. We, we, we have to listen to, to Francisco. <laughs> <laughs> but you, you, talk, you talk only for one thing. Yeah, and um, mm -hmm. uh, for me, the football team is You say the football, the football practice. teams, teams, los equipos de practice. Football. Yeah, it will be, it will be practice, practice. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Yeah, practice. Yeah. If we have a s here, it's practice. Mm -hmm. For me, it's letter A. Mm -hmm. Letter A. Yeah. Let's go. Practices. You were right. Very nice. Very nice. <laughs> Very nice. A ver. Uh -huh. Very nice. Uh -huh. <laughs> Claudia, as well as Judy, American Science Language. Languages. Language. Mm. Oh. Speak. Or speak. Like. Mm -hmm. Is this one is like the other peaks. one we got wrong. Peaks. <laughs> so you have to learn from the mistakes. That's the purpose of learning, right? Making mistakes and learning from them. Ah, yeah. I think so. Is speak. The speak, right? Because this one is exactly uh -huh. as the other three we have wrong. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Speak, letter B. Uh -huh. hmm. Claudia like Judy. Speak. Mm -hmm. Whereas Judy speak. American Science Language. Check. Speak. Speak. Letter B. Letter B. Okay. Uh, no. I have my doubts. Uh -huh. <laughs> So in this case, yeah. if you pay attention, the as well she as Judy, she. no, as well as Judy is in, in between uh -huh, commas. Uh -huh. So that is like extra information, but not the subject. It's not really talking mm -hmm. about Judy. It's talking, it's about, talking about Claudia. About, mm -hmm. uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. That is like yeah. extra mm -hmm. irrelevant information <laughs> as well as Judy. Uh -huh. That's why it's between commas. If they said Claudia. And Judy, Not a lot of that's money uh -huh. is So twenty dollars. Uh -huh. One if, more minute. One more minute. If, Is R. there is a lot? There are lots. Of, oh wait, wait. Yeah, there is R because there's there's no A after the. There are lots of money. Yeah, it's B. What? 
So I was for money. Money. <laughs> money is uncountable. Money doesn't have plural form. So I was right at the beginning. So I was wrong at the end. Yeah, that's why you, you have to listen to your heart. <laughs> <laughs> the first There's answer you think is correct is usually right. B. There is, there are, there am, there be two sides to every argument. Anna? Thirty seconds. Yes. Heal as well as child. And I think grandfather. It's do. Do. I think it's do. Where do you where do you grandfather? But, but you can put B. I think it's where do you A or B. 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 Yeah. Oh. yeah. <laughs> Teacher, we, we we need more time. <laughs> <laughs> the okay. class is more uh, in, in the same topic, teacher. Mm -hmm. Each of the winner received received a scholarship and a trophy. That is the correct answer. Okay, I, a or B. I don't know that. No. Okay. Each of a. Okay. No. Blanca has the reason. <laughs> yeah. Right. Blanca is right. Each. Yeah. I think that R. the word each, e, yeah. we need to put receive. Like singular. Each like singular. <laughs> And I, I don't finish because. Stephanie? Hi, teacher. Hello, did you finish? No. Yes, <laughs> no. Yes, no. <laughs> Almost. All right, so let me see, everybody's back. I think, according to this, is 16 people already connected. And, uh, okay, I want to hear your opinions, guys. It was really interesting to enter the breakout rooms and listen to you um, discussing, trying to answer the, the questions. So group number one, what, what are your comments about- We are this? sad. Oh, uh, Mariela, Diana, uh, Freddy's. I think it, I think it was good to practice practicing group. Uh huh. Because we can hear different opinions. That's right. That's right. Yes. And you were learning together. That was the purpose. Yeah. Okay. Somebody else from the group number two? Nope. Okay, so thank you so much for sharing. Room number three, we have Beatriz, Blanca. Francisco, what can you say about this 
this activity, this quiz that you were having in the breakout rooms? <laughs> First of all, we are confused how to start. <laughs> <laughs> you were confused at the beginning, uh huh, yes. Yeah. But um, apart from that, <laughs> oh, but it's it, it was difficult too uh, because we think that one was the right answer, but not. We we got wrong, but we 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 learn about it. Yes, you learn from your mistakes. Okay. Yes, we that's can right. Code. Excellent. And there were there were many questions that you had no idea, but it's because uh, this topic is very um, extended, right? It's not so short. So. Uh, let's say so easy so simple it's very complex so that's the reason why i like that quiz and i wanted to share it with you so that you could see that there are other uh, variations right and you need to learn about that because in real language in real life you use the language in that way right so let's go on with room number four uh, we had fabio rolando and janari sorry I just I have a question about okay. this. Um, we have an, an example that it was the months usually and the options were spread and spreads through saliva. 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 <laughs> saliva. So but we right. we mark letter A the option. Uh -huh. They spread because of the mumps, but it says it was run. Yes. Do you want? Do you know why? Does anybody know why that answer was? Uh, Hello. Uh huh. The uh -huh. The reason is because mumps is considered singular. Non count is uncountable. Mm. As a disease, it was because as a uh, disease. mumps is a disease, right? Yes, as a disease. If it is as the organ, is it can be plural, but as a disease, is singular. Como enfermedad es singular, pero como parte del cuerpo es plural. En este caso era como enfermedad. Ajá. Uh -huh. Oh. I mean, it's difficult to know that unless you investigate that. So, uh, yeah. and that the same applies to different diseases. I'm going to look it up and I will share that with you. Okay, thank you. So. Good question. <laughs> so, Fabio, you want to say something? Go ahead. Yes, uh, it was an interesting. I know the same question wrong multiple times. <laughs> <laughs> and it does get sometimes confused, but I think I may, may learn something. We, I learned something, right? But I think I, may learn what was wrong in all that sentence and that I see a lot then the answer was one the answer was another and I get so confused that I in the last one that you see was I know it was she but <laughs> would I make the sure. wrong pick okay excellent so yes and uh, I like that I saw that that everybody was getting the the the, the explanation, the answer uh, based on the analysis, right? Like, okay, but in the previous two, we made the same mistake. It was similar to this one, so I think it's this one. So I like to that you got to that conclusion, right, by yourselves, without a teacher, without a book, just by your own uh, deduction, right, by your own analysis. So that is amazing, okay? And it's something important when you're learning a language, that you use logic, that you use uh, this intuition, right? 
um, and that you can learn with other people. So in the breakout room number four, the last one, I mean, yeah, I think number five, it was uh, Roxana, Jennifer, and Juan Jose. I think Jackie was in this group too. Hello? Yeah. Okay, Roxana, go ahead. Okay, uh, I think that the quiz was very interesting, but uh, I have a, a bad connection with my internet, so we have a little bit problems uh, to start solve the, solving, I don't know, mm -hmm. the quiz. So, but then we can um, read the, Okay, um, yeah, I thought that I was the only one having connection problems, but no, I, I think everybody was having the same issues. So um, I'm not sure, I, I, over here it's raining, but I don't know if, it, if you have some uh, interference because of that. So right now we are going to move on guys and um, the, wait a second, okay, got it now. So what you're going to do right now, and I'm going to share, let me check. Yeah, problems with the internet, Jackie, I agree with you right now. It, I feel that it's getting frozen sometimes, um, but anyways. Uh, so take a look at, I mean, you already have the link. So please, I would recommend you to practice one more time because um, Probably not everybody got to finish. And if you do it by yourself and you take your time, you can take notes, it's going to be more beneficial probably. And you will understand more if you practice one more time. So do you have any questions about the questions? Like, do you have any, any, any specific doubt about the test? One question that was not clear for you. Sure. No problem. I will send it to the group. Can you hear me? Yes. Well, if somebody has the WhatsApp uh, app application open right now, you can send it to the group. You can send the link to the group, please. And well, Let's move on. Uh, I cannot share the, 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 the quiz right now, but if you have any doubts, please let me know. I'm going to turn off the, the microphone. I, I mean, can share. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to send. The link. Okay, thank you so much, Blanca. So, um, well. yes. Okay, perfect. So right now, what I need you to do is the following. I'm going to share the screen with you. Wait a second. Okay, right here. So I got a list of vocabulary and, and it's... What you're going to do, can you see the screen, the Word document? Yes, teacher. Okay, perfect. Yes, so can. what you're going to do is in, in your notebook, you are going to make a little bingo chart with nine, nine uh, spaces, nine grids, nine squares, okay, nine. Yay! And, and you are going to write down a, one word in every box one word in every box. Here you have approximately 20 words. So 
select the ones that you like and write them down in the space that you select. In total, you are going to select nine, nine words, okay? This is going to help us to remember some vocabulary that we have studied, to remember the pronunciation, right? And for you to practice listening, right? Identifying the words and uh, spelling because you're going to write them down in your notebook. So select nine words and write, make a little bingo chart, draw a little chart with nine boxes, nine grids. So for this, you have just five minutes, okay? When you finish your chart and you finish writing down nine words, one in every box, please let me know. So you can raise your hand or you can write in the chat, I already finished. Rolando, you, okay, you finished, good. Jackie is finished, okay, Diana. So we have three people who are, re are ready to play the bingo. Okay. So this is very easy, right? So the winner is going to be the person that has, um, that checks, right? Or press out the nine words, if I mention them, <laughs> okay? If I mention them. So the first person to say bingo, to shout bingo is a winner. Okay, so in the meantime, as we wait for the rest of, of, of your classmates to finish uh, drawing their, their bingo short with the vocabulary, I'm going to start pronouncing the words one by one, okay? So you can practice pronunciation with me. Strengths, strengths, lunch, lunch, Idea generation, idea generation as an option. I'm going to add another word here that is basically the same thing that is brainstorming. Okay, brainstorming. Um, weaknesses, weaknesses, branch, branch, come up with. Right now, it's just practice pronunciation, right? Come up with purchase. Yeah. Purchase, yes. Purchase. I am practicing pronunciation right now. We're we haven't started with the bingo game, right? So okay, purchase. <laughs> we continue with product line. He said that I before. Said, <laughs> yeah, yeah. You have to listen. You have to listen. Okay. Uh idea screening, business analysis test marketing, target audience, positioning, manufacturing, manufacturing yeah. prototype, prototype, concept development, opportunities, threats, disadvantages, 
competitor, and product testing. Yep. Bingo. What? You're kidding me, Yanari. <laughs> uh, no. Nah. No bingo this time, okay? No, we were me. I, I, I was. We are I, practicing. I am practicing the pronunciation, the pronunciation of the words. <laughs> I think that is having some internet connection problem, so I probably didn't listen when I said that. Okay. <laughs> but it's okay. You, you, you are practicing right now, okay? When you're going to say bingo. So, ready? Right now, I stop sharing. I stop sharing. You need to have your words ready, okay? If you say bingo, you are you are oh, going to. No. You, if you say bingo, you are going to share your 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 picture, right? Of uh, of your notebook, of your page. And the WhatsApp group. Yes, but well, uh, we have evidence. But when you finish, okay? Right now, we are going to start, okay, with the bingo. So I'm ready. First word, okay. the first word, the first word is prototype, no. prototype. Next one, <laughs> idea screening, idea screening. Next word, weaknesses, weaknesses. Yeah. Don't say yes, don't say no. Okay, next one. Competitor. Competitor. Next one. Purchase. Purchase, yes. Next one. Strengths. Strength, yes. Next word. Disadvantages. Next one. Come up with. Come up with. Next word. Idea generation. Idea generation. Mm. Next word. Opportunities. Okay, no bingo yet. Next one. Target audience. Target audience. Next word. No. Launch. Launch. Next one. Manufacturing. Manufacturing. Next word, business analysis. Business analysis. Okay. Um, the winner, with the winner, I am going to share a playlist of music in English, okay, through WhatsApp. So that will be the price for the winner. Next one. Concept development. Concept development. No bingo? Okay, let's continue with the next one. That is branch. 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 No. Next. next word, brainstorming. No, we don't have brainstorming. Next one. Yeah. Next one is positioning. Positioning. Oh. Yeah. The next one is threats. But yes. But. No bingo. My goodness, I'm going to finish the words. How is that possible? Oh, that nobody has them all. Next word is product line. Bingo! Bingo! <laughs> <laughs> okay. What happened? Okay, so you have to send a picture uh, as an evidence to the WhatsApp group, uh, Diana, so that we can... To say bingo, yeah. Indiana wins. Okay. <laughs> okay, so that will be all. Uh, thank you so much. So we are done with the fun Friday with the bingo short. Let me see the evidence. Launch threats, okay, pro line, branch forces, competitor opportunities, target audience, and position. Yeah, I mentioned all of them. So congratulations, okay. Reactions for <laughs> the winners this the winner this time. So I'm going to send the link to of the playlist later, Diana. Thank you so much for playing. I hope that you yeah, liked it. Was, uh...
Now, guys, the weekend is coming. Okay, so it's it's, a, it's a time for you to catch up with the teacher with the assignments. You Hello? you have you mentioned witnesses? Witnesses. Uh... No. <laughs> yes. Wow, okay. okay. That's... I I mentioned you mentioned that yes. when a uh, long time ago. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that I'm is sorry. sad because the internet, had it. Uh, the internet probably, yeah, yeah. Okay, so I think Diana will share the playlist with you later, but you like BTS, so I don't uh, probably you don't like my music. <laughs> So uh, we're going to move on, guys. Do you have any questions or comments before we finish with today's session? I'm just going to give you some final indications, okay, about the weekend. So first of all, it's about the, the assignments, right, that you have to do on the platform online. So uh, you need to be done with the first week, okay, with the first unit, and that it finishes on the exercise. Uh, let me check. I think it was 1.5. That was the last homework. Um, so that that was one thing that you have to, that I have to tell you, right, or remind you that you have to uh, catch up with the assignments this weekend, please, so that you don't accumulate the, for the next the next one. So this is the second session of the week two. Okay. Remember, we didn't start on Monday. We started the classes on Thursday. So this is the session number two of the week two. That would be the, the class number seven. So um, you need to catch up and start working with the first exercises of the unit number two. So um, if you have doubts when you are completing the exercises, yes, you can ask questions, right? I cannot give you the answer, uh, okay, because you need to try first, but I can give you a clue. I can give you a clue. Um, with the strategies that I shared with you for speaking or improving your speaking skills that I shared through the WhatsApp group yesterday, try to practice, okay? Try to practice those because it's really important that you find the... the find a way to practice by yourself. So, I mean, if you practice in class, it's excellent, but it's not enough. You need to practice every day by yourself, okay? With other people, that would be perfect. But if you don't have a partner, you can do it by yourself. So try to put into practice the strategies that I shared in that document. There were eight different strategies. And uh, review, review what we study in class, because as you can see, we have topics, grammar, vocabulary, okay? The pronunciation that is important. So the more you study, the more you understand. Uh, so I'm going to take the attendance quickly to check that everybody's here. Uh, Suleyma and Elizabeth didn't join us today. Uh, here, Roxana. Present teacher, present. Nice, Janari. I'm here. Rolando. Fabio. Fabio. I'm here. Okay, perfect. Uh, let me check if the connection is better now. I'm going to try to connect to my Wi-Fi because it stopped raining in Samuel. So probably now you can see me. Okay. Uh, can you see me? Yes, no. Hello. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for staying. Thank you for staying. Okay. Um, I thought that you were going to leave. Like, okay, it's time. The teacher is not here. Let's go. 
No. Uh... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wait for this. I, I know that it, that you thought about that, but no, I'm here, so I'm going to say to finish saying the names. Um, uh, well, Luis, I said Fabio and Rolando, but I I don't know if you heard my name. If you heard your name, okay, okay. yeah. Uh, Gustavo was driving on the way to a watch Juan yours. Jose. Juan Jose, Jennifer, excellent. Uh, Jackie. Here. Freddy's. <laughs> nice. I'm here. Okay, uh, Francisco. Present teacher. Okay, uh, Floor. Diego. Diana. Here. Diana. Here. Brenda. Blanca. I'm here. Nice. Mariela. I'm here. And Beatriz. Okay. Perfect. So as I was telling you, right, you need to catch up with the assignments from the unit one. The last uh, homework is 1.9. Okay. That's the last homework from the unit one on the platform, right? And, um, okay. And the person for today, for the last 10 minutes is Janati. I don't know if you can stay tonight, Janati. You can try. Yeah, I have problem with my internet too, teacher. Okay, so that makes that that makes two of us. <laughs> <laughs> so yes. let's 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 try to stay connected <laughs> uh, <Janari. laughs> okay. Uh, okay so guys uh, if you don't have any any other comment or question thank you so much for your patience tonight because the connection was a headache uh it was really really funny to see you uh competing and having fun as you were doing uh, the discussion and the activities in group. Um, so enjoy the weekend, rest, right? Do whatever you like. Take care of yourself, right? Stay away from the, from from crowds. And um, I'll see you again on Monday, God willing. Okay, so blessings for all of you. Good night, happy weekend. Have a nice weekend. Have a nice weekend, guys. See you guys. Good night. Good night. Take care. Sweet dreams. Good night. Au revoir. What? <laughs> what did you say, Diana? I didn't hear you. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, no, Yanari, what Yanari is going to try ah. to stay with me. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. We are going to try to stay connected. <laughs> we have to try. <laughs> yes, we have to try. We have to, we have, because we have. Hello. Hello. Can you hear me, teacher? Yes, yeah. I can hear you. Okay, okay, uh, teacher, and I have pro um, I I need to understand more about reduce uh, adverb. Oh, about reduce adverb. Yeah, teacher. All right. So let me go back to this part right here. So, uh, okay, so this is uh, what we did uh, last time, right? About, uh, well, this was about the present perfect. Then we had the, mm -hmm. I explained it, and then we do this exercise, right? 
So uh, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. So in this ex, I will I will try to explain you with this exercise, right? What the reduced adverbs is. So the number one is is just an example, right? About the two clauses that we put together when we use the the okay, adverb clauses, mm -hmm. right? But the let's focus more on the number two, three, and four. So um, basically, what you need to remember is that uh, the adverb clauses mm -hmm. we, we make of time in this case, uh, we make them with a preposition of time like after, while, before, since. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. And um, mm -hmm. and two statements or two sentences, right? One yeah. is independent, yeah. that is the, the main plus, and the other one is mm -hmm. dependent, that is the one that has the preposition, mm -hmm. the, the preposition of time. So in this case, mm -hmm. if, while I worked as an accountant, I learned a lot about management. That was the correct answer. Um, I'm going to write it down here. Before. While. Before. While. I worked as an accountant. I learned a lot about management. So mm -hmm. the independent, mm -hmm. I learned about a lot about management. And the mm -hmm. dependent one is while I worked as an accountant. This is not mm -hmm. complete. So this is. Dependent, ah, okay. Dependent, uh -huh, right? uh -huh. Or we can call it advert class. Mm -hmm. And the other one is uh -huh. the main plus. The main. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we have the two classes, right? Um, uh -huh, uh -huh. Then. Uh, this is the normal one, right? But then what we try to yeah. do is a reduction. So for the reduction, mm -hmm. there, are, there are some rules that we need to follow. So for example, the rule number one is uh, eliminate the subject. Eliminate the subject. Okay, first of all, you need to In identify you need to oh. identify, wait, you need to identify if it is possible uh -huh. to make a reduction. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. To make a reduction, you need to have the same subject in the two classes, right? We talk about the same person, about the same thing in the two. In this case, while I worked, I learned. So it's I, I, it's the same person. Uh, yeah. But if I say, while I work as an accountant, my mother learned a lot. Uh -huh. I and uh -huh. my mother are two different subjects. So it's not possible. So oh, okay. we have the two, the, the, the two subjects are the same then it's possible mm -hmm. to make a reduction. And as you mentioned, mm -hmm. the reduction number one is when we eliminate the subject in mm -hmm. the adverb class. We eliminate the subject mm -hmm. in the adverb class. So here, mm -hmm. we eliminate the subject here. And the subject in this case is I. I, yeah. So we eliminate it, right? Mm -hmm. So wait. Mm -hmm. Goodbye. It doesn't exist anymore. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. that's the first thing. The second thing that we do is if the clause has a form of the verb be, we eliminate the verb be. In this case, we don't have the verb be. Okay. We don't have the verb be. So we have the uh -huh. verb worked. So we are going to worked. add. Mm -hmm. What are we going to add to the verb? Verb. A -A I I N G. I N G. So in this case, mm -hmm. while right. while while working. Working. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. As an accountant. accountant. As an accountant, very good. While working as an accountant, uh -huh. I learned I a learned lot about a lot, lot about a lot about managing. management. About management, that's correct. So ah, okay, okay. That's how we do it. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Um, 
companies have changed the way they do marketing. Well, in this case, uh, since they adapted to the new trends and new generations. So in this example, in particular, we agreed that it is possible, it is possible to, to uh -huh. make a reduction because we say companies and we say they, yes? Mm -hmm. We refer yeah. to the same, the same uh, subject, but if we eliminate, if we eliminate, for example, a, they, they uh -huh. if we eliminate they, let me eliminate it. If we eliminate they, since adapted and we add the ing. Uh-huh, adapting. Uh-huh, since adapting. Uh, since adapting to the new trends. Companies have changed the way they do marketing since adapting to the new trends and new generations. Does it make sense? Like, if you translate it, you are like, okay, it's not, it's not logical, right? Mm -hmm. So in this case, we got to the conclusion that it is possible to make a reduction, but it doesn't make sense if we do uh -huh. it. So, ah, okay, ah, okay. Correct. And then in the number mm -hmm. four, uh, after, while, or before? Uh, well. After, while, or before? After. The supervisor uh, conducts a SWOT analysis. She sends an email to all the employees so they are aware about it in advance. Uh, after. Mm, after. No. Is this yes. mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Before. Before. Okay. Correct. Before. Before. Yes. Before the supervisor conducts a SWOT analysis, so it is possible to make a reduction here. It is possible because we say the supervisor and she, right? So the supervisor is a woman. Um. Mm -hmm. So in this case, a. Uh, what is the the possibility so uh, if we eliminate if we eliminate the supervisor mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. because it's she it, like she before uh -huh, and then we say before conducting right before conducting mm -hmm. before conducting yeah. Conducting a SWOT analysis, she sends an email to all the employees she so they are aware an email. about it in advance. Mm, uh -huh. yeah, it yeah, is possible, yeah, exactly. but in this case, what mm -hmm. is the problem? Um, if we say she sends an email, who we don't know who we are talking about. Mm -hmm. So for that reason, uh, Diana made mm -hmm. the, the observation, right? That in this case, what we need to do is to change the vocabulary. Mm -hmm. Instead of she, uh -huh. you mention the supervisor. So the correct answer would be before conducting a SWOT analysis, comma, the supervisor sends an email to all the employees so they are aware about it in advance. Mm -hmm. yes. Ah, okay, okay. The supervisor. Yes. Like, we, um, we need to specify who we're talking about, okay? Ah, okay, yes. okay. Okay, teacher, thank you. You're I, welcome. I'm more clear. Now everything is, is clearer. Yeah, yeah, it's clearer. Excellent. So thank you, Nadi. I know you have to take care of your thank daughter. Thank you so much. So, bye bye. Yeah, my son is my son. Your son. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, teacher. Uh, uh, good he's great because he is sleep. He's <laughs> good night, oh, teacher. Sorry. Thank you. Okay. Thank Happy you for weekend. staying. Happy weekend for you too. Thank you, teacher. Bye bye. Bye.